This is Sparta! For our sons! For our daughters! For Sparta! Have one of those. So this is going to be a very interesting experience. Annapurna Interactive. Hello everyone. Uh, welcome to Outer Wilds. This is a game... I... It just... I just... It just popped up one day. And I saw it in the Epic Store. And... I don't know. I, I was just drawn to it. It's the way the art style looks. Profile name. Spartan... 431 BC. Create. Uh, okay, new expedition. I guess. I'm assuming this is what I'm supposed to do. But I liked the way the art style looked. And, again, that's, that's all I know about it. When I first saw it, where it said Outer Wilds, I thought it said Outer Worlds. Which, and that's the reason I clicked on it to begin with. I was thinking it was had something to do with the Outer Worlds game that is being made by Obsidian. Uh, to my knowledge, this has nothing to do with that. I'm, I'm eager to get in and take a look at it. E to wake up. Whoa! See, I really like this. Look at this! Requires launch codes. Okay. Well, sup, dude? Moonshine! Oh, no. Um, hi. Talk to Slate. Whoa, gosh! There's our pilot. Back from your pre launch camp out under the stars, I see. Am I one of you? Okay. I don't even see the rocket. Oh, it's probably just on top of that tree. Alright, so I've got to go... That's odd. That That's odd jumping. Well, hi, Micah. <gasps> hey, it's you! Slate said you're blasting off in your ship still. I'm really excited to see the launch. Aren't you gonna go into space? Aren't you? You better not change your mind. I'm still going. You better be. It's been forever since anyone launched into space. I really, really want to see it. Really bad. Hey, want to try out my model ship? Slate says it's just like the real thing, only less likely to start a fire. <laughs> oh, I like you, Micah. Where's your model ship? Oh. Oh, go oh gosh! Listen to this music. This music reminds me of the very beginning, the beginning scenes in Lone Survivor. Porphy! Hello, Hatchling. I hear you're leaving us to seek adventure amongst the stars. When you return, let's you, me, and Gossip open a bottle of good stuff. Always seeking your bed. Another metaphor ruined in the name of scientific accuracy. Nevertheless, I do hope you enjoy your travels. Good luck!
Outer Outer Wilds Ventures presents postcards from orbit. Projectors linked to our sky shutter satellite we experiment where we can our satellites with two onboard cameras. See if we can take a snapshot of our village. Okay. I mean, I kind of got the snapshot. More rockets. Pilots, the pilot seat used by pioneering astronaut Feldspar is all that remains of our inaugural flight into space. It's been honored such a secret parts of the liberal definition of flight that they would nevertheless always be remembered as a landmark achievement in Herthian history. So we're Herthians. Time. We're actually blasting off in that thing, huh? We're going to slow this off anyway. All I know is between the space program and Michael's model rockets, they seem to burn to the ground around here more often than they used to. Ah, uh, I like it. Can I swim? Alright, it's not deep enough to swim, but... Doesn't look like water instantly kills me. Marl! So it's lunch day, huh? Al's gonna miss you. Wait a minute. No, he's a, he's a lumberjack. He's gotta have... <coughs> Speaking of launch day, I was thinking about it. And the platform those ships launch from is getting old. It's been about time you built a new, less flammable one. That big tree in the village would be the perfect choice. I wouldn't mind helping out in the space program. Just say the word. Current launch pad is fine. Oh, uh, really? Dang. Well, maybe someone needs a porch or something. A big one. You really, you really got it out for that tree, huh? Ooh. Oh, that's cool. That is... Oh, that's cool. So, I'm guessing that's the launch pad, because that's the elevator. It's been up there so long, it's... It, if you look at the tree right here, it's been blackened. There's a fuel, the fire is burned down. It burned out this hollowness in the tree. That is cool. That's a nice little attention to detail. Denise. I forgot who I'm supposed, I'm supposed to go up to the observatory. Hello, Ruler Space Cadet. I hear you're leaving the crater today. Meet any other travelers up there? Remind them to take proper care of their instruments. I think about travelers' instruments. Ooh. I'm sure I made all their instruments. Oh, sure. I've made all their instruments, you know. Let's see. There's Chet's drums, Previx banjos, and Gavro's flute, and Feldspar's harmonica, of course. But the Feldspar's been missing for a long time. Sometimes it feels like just yesterday they were playing the harmonica around the campfire. Well, that's sad. Anyway, you hear music in space, that'll be one of the space program's other travelers. If you feel like company, you can always pull out your signal scope and track them down. Thanks, Kinesis. Observatory's up there. Hi, guys. Uh, I'm I'm gonna go and I'm gonna get stuff. I'm not gonna talk to everyone else. I'm I'm, I'm running out of voices. I want I want to talk to you though. You're fishing. Fishing rhyme, fishing rhyme. Singing helps me pass the time. We're leaving the crater. Guess we'll all be a little busier once you're around and ahead. That big water planet, giant deep, that's where I go. One time after the rest of the village had left to sleep, it was just the two of us sitting around the campfire. Gabro told me about the first trip to giant deep. They landed the ship easily enough in the world. Couldn't see too far down. Not how murky the water was, just too dark. Gabro wants to see what lay beneath the surface. So they decided to travel deeper. They traveled down and down. Suddenly, Gabro couldn't go further. I, I will. I was just pausing the magic. Oh, that's cool. The tentacle of some hideous beast! What? The Kraken! I did. I know I didn't like it. I was, again, I'm kind of just trying to... Oh, crap. I was... I was trying to jump, but jumping is different.
to do. Yeah, jumping is a little bit odd. I imagine that's gonna be very nice later when I'm on lower gravity planet. Listen to that, look at that! Ooh, is that my ship? Oh, that's the observatory. Oh, wow! What are you? Use camera. I can't aim up. Whoa! Okay. Um, note to self. Don't go in the crystals. I gotta roll... God. Oh, this is nice. How burnt can I get him? Oh, too burnt. Yeah. That's how my dad likes them. My dad likes them like black like that. What happens if I toss it? Does this appear? Oh, it just... It just, like, literally flies off. I like him um, like that. This game is gorgeous, however. I really like this art style. Alright, I'm not going to talk to the, the same people again, because that's just going to be redundant. Let's uh, get back to the, let's get to the observatory. Yep, yep, yep. And it's got amazing music. Shooting star! I kind of want to jump down the waterfall, but I don't want to lose none of my progress. Remarkable attacks was created by the Nomai, an ancient species was. They look, they almost look like, um, teethlings from D&D, but with a couple extra horns. Whoa! What are we talking about? Whoa, wait a minute! What? I want to read that again. That's weird. Is that a real thing? Does that actually happen on Earth? Any physicists or astrophysicists out there, let me know. I want to know. Does that explain why, like, things are in different places on my table and stuff? Does that explain why we think my workplace is haunted? Hi. Are these all the planets in the solar system? Huh. Ah, is that a supernova? Yeah, 
Yeah. One maybe the fate of our own son. What are you? You're like an evil anglerfish. This anglerfish specimen is found in one here. It's just flew close. Was found, was found attached to the landing gear of one of our ships that flew close to Dark Bramble. Appears well suited to living in dark places with minimal atmosphere. So is it a space creature? Or is it a planet creature? That's what I want to know. This was taken from a Know My Ruin on Brittle Hollow. Seems to create a local gravity distortion. It's most likely used to traverse steep surfaces. Try it out. What? It's like the museum. It's like the original, like, movie. It's like the Air and Space Museum. Ooh, that really reminds me of a story about your uncle. Of my uncle. Hmm. That's interesting. Alright, let's go get the launch codes from the guy. View map. Oh! Gosh! Okay. Um. Oh, look at these. That's cool. Is that a thing that happens? Can you have two planets in a polar orbit like that around each other? I can I honestly I don't know. So that's the planet with the weird thing, Hollow's Lantern. That's this is the ocean planet. And that's the thing I saw blow up. I want to go investigate that once we're once we're out of here. Hmm. There you are. I just finished pre-flight observations and local conditions are good. Time to get our newest astronaut off the ground. You'll be our first astronaut ever equipped with a the Nomai Translator tool. I confess, I've been giddy all day just thinking about it. You're better equipped than ever to unravel the mysteries of the Nomai. You and Hal should be very proud of your work. Aren't you Hal? I thought you were Hal. I'll start with something small. Oh no, I'm going to I'm going to the deep. Those are the launch codes. Now I'm I'm going to the um I'm going to Helm's Deep or whatever the place was. I know it's not Helm's Deep, but I'm going to that place. Oh gosh, that's so weird. That's so cool. And I mean, I know how it's done in the context of the video game. It's fairly obvious. And I'm just, I'm just gonna... Whoa! That's cool. It's the original crew, I'm guessing. Mornfels, Gosen, Slate, Feldspar. Ooh, 
Well, this thing down here says Eskar. Esker. That's cool. So freaking cool. Hi, Hal. Yeah, it, um... I'm still good. Thanks, pal. So far, I feel like the only person I'm really gonna like miss is Mika. Mika was just so excited. Tefra, I like your hat. Wait, could I have just gone this way? Okay, no. I was about I was about to say. We're gonna fixing the autopilot's avoidance for this one. So it's not fixed now. Okay, um, <laughs> Let's see how long I don't crash. Let's see how long it takes me to crash. It's my suit. Yeah, I want I want to go to Giant's Deep first. I'll return the suit. I don't think I necessarily need it for the purposes of takeoff, but. Oh gosh! Look at the map. How do I pick where to go? I wanna go... Alright, so the autopilot is working. I'm not gonna do it, but I wonder whether or not I can open the hatch without my suit on and just like kill myself. I, I shouldn't have come here first. Bad choice. Okay. 
I'm gonna try to... anything else. I don't... Not that map. Okay, let's, um... Wait a minute, 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 wait a minute. Uh, 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 uh. Uh! Oh no! Um... Let's not go to that planet this time. Let's figure out how to actually fly the ship. out one of these twins. I forgot how to open map. Ah, there's map. Okay. Yeah, so, uh, Giant's Deep is death. These planets are all very, very small. Exploded though. I, I gotta, I gotta pick something, and then we'll definitively like explore it. Ugh! We're gonna go to the Adel Rock, cause that was like the kind of main location. That people were recommending I go. All right, so we're decelerating at five kilometers. Okay, 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 okay. 
Okay, okay. Land it. Well, um, another happy landing. Put the suit on. That's one small step for Herthian. Woohoo! One giant leap for Herthian kind. Crap, I'm stuck in a creek. Crap, I'm stuck in a crater. Oh no. What? Jesus. Oh, this is cool. We're on the dark side of the moon. Oh gosh. Whoa. Jetpack. But... Didn't someone tell me there were ruins on the moon? Oh, 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 no, no, no! No, 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 no! No, no! Oh, oh, come on, come on, come on, come on! Come on! Don't do me like this! Come on, come on, come on! Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh. Okay, that little bit of damage was worth it. I almost died in the cold, hard vacuum of space. Oh, that's so creepy. It's a very sm this is a very small solar system. Okay, there we go. And now, I'm gonna look for those ruins that I thought I saw as I was flying away into space. I mean, this planet's... I mean, it's not a planet, it's a moon. It's not especially large. But I, I feel like that last... It's an interesting shape. Oh, oh, ooh. Oh, hey, Esker.
Talk to you later, Esker. Sad that no one ever comes and sees him. Okay, so it's talking about his whistling is the identified signal. had the harmonica. Uh, Feldspar had the harmonica, right? He's back on Earth. And our drummer guy is on one of the twins. Alright, let's uh, get back to the ship. And I want to go and find Feldspar. Feldspar's like right there. But he went missing years ago. But he's back on. But he's back on Timber Hearth. Let's, uh. I fully repaired. Nope.
Well, this is home, so... What needs to be repaired? There's gotta be stuff being repaired. Alright, where's... I'm on the right planet, right? When I have access to my map, I need to put on the suit. There we go. There we go. He's here. He's definitely here. Oh, and that's... Oh, gosh. Vitals low. Ah. I really found Feldspar. Hello, Hatchley. Thought you were taking that tin candy out of space today. What's you doing here? Wait a minute. Feldspar's in that. in the thing. Holy crap. I don't know what to do with this information. Oh, oh. Okay, vital's critical. Okay. Um... Well, um, man, Feldspar is wrapped in a dark bramble seed. What are the implications of this? I don't know. I haven't been to the dark bramble yet. That'll be next episode when I'll go to the dark bramble. See if I can unlock a little bit more of this mystery. But in the meantime, so. We've just begun. Because now, Feldspar is in there. And that's a dark bramble seed. But we gotta find out why. And I'm gonna do that in the next video. And I'll see you guys all in the next video. Thank you for watching. Stay Spartan strong. Aroo! Aroo! Aroo!